Everyone has had one thing that they can't let go of. A, a few are fine, but what happens when you start getting more and more and more? At some point, you have to admit it's time to say goodbye. Here are seven of the most common items that you've probably held on to for far too long. I'm Rob Hundley with the AZ Realty by Rob team from Asher Kine Real Estate. I post lots of content about real estate tips and tricks and the Phoenix market in particular. So be sure to subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss anything. Number one, clothes and shoes you never wear. Face it, you have a closet full of clothes and shoes. How many of those do you actually wear? Each, each year I put all of my clothes on one side of a bright pink ham hanger. Then once I wear something, I rehang it on the other side. That makes it easy to keep track of what I wear. At the end of the year, I donate all of these clothes that are over here that haven't moved. Two, old cookware. <laughs> Cooking has changed so dramatically over the last few years. How many items in your kitchen do you still use? Do you still have both your deep fryer and air fryer or Instapot and pressure cooker? Do you have worn out skillets or, or baking sheets that, that you've replaced? Get rid of them. Closets and kitchens collect the most clutter. Number three, unnecessary paperwork. What do you hold on to that you don't need to? Owner's manuals, they have those online. Bank statements from two accounts ago, bills, receipts, the list goes on and on. Ask your accountant what you need to keep and for how long. Shred anything with your personal information before you toss it though. Four, expired medications. Don't let your nosy friends be the only ones who poke through your medicine cabinet. Anything that you are no longer taking or that's past its expiration date, those can all be returned to your local pharmacy. Five, old makeup. Like many things, makeup has an expiration date. Clean out expired makeup, as well as the ones that you don't use anymore. Bonus item, <clears throat> old spices and foods too. How old is that jar of capers sitting in your refrigerator door? Declutter your pantry and spice rack, replace with fresh, and you'll be amazed at how much better it tastes. Okay, number six can get a little touchy, greeting cards. Ask a group of people how long to hold on to greeting cards and you'll get some very emphatic answers. Some people, let's call them my wife, think that cards should be kept forever. Now, some you need to hold on to for sentimental value. But most, especially the annual celebratory cards, those can be cleared out. Finally, number seven, poop bags. While we've gotten better at carrying reusable bags, we still acquire a collection of plastic ones. Besides serving as poop bags when we walk our dog, I really haven't found any good uses for them. Instead of just stuffing them in a drawer, recycle them. <laughs> Spend some time sorting through each of these and you'll be amazed at how the energy and feel of your house changes. What's the one thing you have a hard time getting rid of? Leave it in the comments below. Thanks for watching.